Hey there, how are you doing? This is Kali from Techfancy. So it's been a month since we have posted a video on our uh, MI A2. So this is currently running on Arrow OS. So this is uh, the build uh, unrecognized or they have deleted it after some time or something. So this one is currently running with the uh, our uh, Android 13 and August 5th security patch. So August, September, October, November. So now what we are going to do is in the official uh, mia2 community uh, we have the pixel experience unofficial but we also have the official pixel experience which is much more uh, stable than android 13 but i am more interested in android 13 so i am going a little bit back so here we have the uh, tequila os uh, for our uh, mi a2 so which is third uh, android 13 so here you can see it is official uh, stable so i just downloaded this for the mi a2 already so this one we also have for uh, vein uh, mi 6x so yeah i have downloaded it it is uh, uh, still this is last month update so after that there is no much uh, tra traction in the group so what I have done is I have the Jasmine Sprout here. I have the Tequila OS Tobacco. So this is the one I am currently going to install and this OS is encrypted. So I have to use the uh, ADB side load method. So in here we already have the ADB fast boot tool, which I will be making use of to uh, do the side load. So now I'll just click here and we don't have the advanced reboot option so i'll just uh, uh, try to normal uh, power off and then i need to use volume um, volume down and volume up and uh, uh, power key so to boot into the twrp yeah okay so this one doesn't have the TWRP. This one has the uh, error voice recovery. I just installed it. Uh, it will automatically install, but I'll just go here and here I can't uh, install the recovery. So I'll just reboot to the bootloader. So now I'll connect to my USB-C and you can see the phone is detected. So here I'll type uh, fast boot devices. So we have the device in here and I will do fast boot boot and then I will go to my arcade folder where I have the uh, MIA2 related files. So in here I should have be should be having this uh, TWRP so I am going to use that one. So uh, before that, I need to check whether is there, uh, if there is any requirement. So uh, user build it is improve video playback and scrolling uh, experience and ship to Scarlet X, uh, Scarlet X kernel and calf tweaks uh, revert old brightness config updated to pixel power hall to Android 13. So it is October uh, security patch with waiting this thing double tap to sleep on uh, this one. Okay, QS style is only one tab instead of holding. Um, added unlinked volume. This one, okay. Thank you for under the reset the wallpaper to fix the flickering issues. And it is not encrypted, that is one of the good things. Okay, so uh, uh, yeah, it will they are telling it will be having a, a wallpaper issue which we need to. Um, change the wallpaper something so there is no recommendation or something for the twrp so the same twrp recovery so i'm going to use the same recovery here and um, yeah so now fast boot boot and then i will just drag and drop this uh, recovery and click enter okay so now we have the TWRP here, allow modifications and it doesn't show the internal storage because currently whatever ROM I have, uh, it is encrypted. So what I'm going to do? Well, I'm going to format the data 
and yeah warning formatting data will erase all your internal storage so uh, i already took a pack backup of all the things so that is not going to that is not going to be a big issue so now i have uh, formatted the data and uh, now i will try to uh, go here and install recovery ram disk so here i need to select the storage the storage is now visible i believe yeah in my pc i'll go to uh, here the device is enabled so uh, i'll just copy this uh, twrp and go here and i'll just paste it so now for install recovery disk so here i have the ram uh, this one recovery now so i'll flash and install it it is taking some time so yeah yeah now it is installed so what i am going to do i will go to reboot to the recovery so currently it, it is in b partition so yeah okay so settings and i don't know why the brightness is uh, this much low it usually happens so uh, what i need to do now i'll just uh, 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 go back and i'll go to and select uh, install but before that i will just uh, copy this uh, um, i'll go to mia2 so here i have the storage so what i'll do i'll go to downloads and here i have takila os so i'll just paste there so once it is pasted we will uh, try to install it from here itself as this one doesn't have the micro sd card support sometimes it will be hectic yeah now the takila os is uh, for this one uh, so i'll unlock it and i'll go here uh, wipe uh, wipe system cache this four things i will wipe and this one also what i am trying to do is uh, if i do here it will install in the a partition right so i'll go here and install it okay so here uh, it is showing that it will be it will install in the a partition okay so after installing this i have to install the twrp once again or something and i'll just reboot to the recovery to see if it is uh, what it is doing also i have this uh, uh, forgetting mentality so what i do is i'll just here i type uh, installed installed os in a partition okay so yeah okay now it has successfully installed it showed some error so that is fine i be i believe so i'm just deleting the um, formatting cache and other things so um here if i go again to the storage uh, uh storage or what it's saying is the card here i have the uh, twrp so which i have to uh, install it uh, so i will select uh, this one and i do um, maybe i think it is uh, good to have the this one what i would say um, 
the actual Takila OS recovery so I don't need to install the TWRP again so first what I do is I will just reboot to the my current slot is A so sir B so it will it has to reboot to uh, A but uh, for to make sure I will just select a A slot so yeah A why if I select A it is just reboot to recovery I am unable to select the current slot as A or something so that is still an issue what I can do whatever I will just uh, okay let us just reboot if it is not booting then uh, we will switch the uh, slot from our uh, PC or something okay So it is not booting which means uh, this one didn't change the slot to A slot so what I do I will just uh, boot to fast boot mode and in my PC I have the command to set the uh, partition to A so that's how I have mentioned it here the installed OS this thing will happen always happen to me for MIA too so <laughs> I will just uh, do this one. So now the partition has been set. I will just reboot to first boot uh, reboot. So yeah. Now it should boot into the Takila OS. Yeah. You can see it is booting to Takila OS. So you can uh, use this uh, method fast boot dash dash set dash uh, active A or if you have installed it B partition you need to choose as B or else uh, the, uh, the method which we use earlier is just uh, fast boot boot and boot the TWRP and from there you try to change it to the other partition so yeah so if you have any doubts on the slots uh, I have made on a dedicated video explaining the things so which you can watch in the card appears right now okay so now we have booted into i did install the sim but but not sure why it is okay now it is uh, finding the sim card so yeah that is great and i'll connect to my network now this cable is not required Sorry. So here you can see this one is also has the phase unlock so I can use a pattern and fingerprint and then get okay so we now have installed the uh, Takila OS and now I can go to settings and here we have Android 13 um, October uh, security patch it is running currently and it has the Scarlet uh, X uh, Kernel and here we have uh, show me parts for some uh, audio related things and we have uh, we don't have any dedicated customization option uh, it is same like that arrow OS so yeah I will be using this uh, OS for next few days or something and then I will get back to you with the uh, status on how the things are uh, working 
so yeah that's what about uh, installing the android 13 on our uh, mi 8 so thanks for watching code metal